I can't believe I didn't record this. Oh my god. Got him. Oh, I got him. Fucking got him. Oh, man, I got him. If there was anything that deserved to praise the sun, that definitely was it. We definitely need to jump for that one. Jump. Heavy as this armor is, this skill jump. Holy shit, man. That's the only thing next to see is what we get for this. Now it begs the question, I wonder if I would have killed him before we got pulled into Ariando, if we would still be facing him as a boss, man. I think that's a pretty legitimate uh, question. Let's see what we got. Oh, I'm pretty sure that that crossbow is going to be one of the weapons. Oh, the crossbow is it? Like, no sword? For the reason, I felt like we should be getting the sword. Well, we should have been getting the sword. Oh, yeah, here he is. Blade of Peril. Great sword of slave knight deal. Only what weapon that he kept with him from beginning to end. Originally, an executioner sword made for decapitation. His blade is heavily chipped and stained with the blood of countless battles. Curious technique unique to undead Gale. Leap in any direction, slamming a great sword to the ground, and follow with normal attack for large spinning or strong slam. Uh, not like I use these a lot. I don't know, it seems like I'm always buying the swords, but I never use the swords. That's the thing. Swords like that. See what else we 
else has got, because I'm pretty sure I can get rid of these, uh, these ashes. Ah, well, how may I be of sir? Ashen one, bring me with... Is it not? <laughs> Ashen one, bring... Is it... <laughs> Ashen one... <laughs> Pigment to depict a painted world. Blood. Use his pigment. By his lady in Ariandel. Picked a painted world. Gale came upon the pygmy lords. So their blood had long ago dried. So consumed the dark soul. Last of them, but I regret to say, Quelan, but thank you, if only I will. Oh. Do not be gone for long. Ah, it is good. What neat. Uh. Pretty be careful. We wouldn't be able to tell you now. I wonder if we can buy his armor. I haven't seen if we could buy his armor. I think we should. Seem like some things moved around. stuff. I would ain't get none from her. Nothing. Ashen one. Ashen one for the Lord Link. Ashen one. Maybe if we go back to Ariando, maybe we'll be able to get something. Only maybe I can use these as just a collection of either that's just a collection item or either that's just a collection item or we actually supposed to give that to somebody. Uh, it 
will be something if we're, suc- if we're supposed to go back to Ariano. I'm curious to see if, there, if there's anything back there waiting on us. I'm going to go back there and see. I'm actually curious, I'm going to go back. Just for whatever reason, I got this feeling. Since it said that it's pigment or a painting. Wasn't that little girl up there painting? Uh, he was painting something. It'll be something if we have to give it to her. I'm not. Pushing out the realm of possibilities. Where's that ladder? Ah, so y'all are supposed to give it to her. Okay. My thanks, Ashen One. With this, will I paint a world? Please tell me thy name. I would name this painting after thee. My thanks. I will paint a world of that name. It will be a cold, dark, and very gentle place. And one day... It will make someone a goodly home. I wonder when Uncle Gale intends his return. I hope the new painting will be to him a gentle home. Oh wow, so this guy was his girl was his niece. My thanks. I will a shook of a cold one day. So that being the case. I'm wondering if there's anything else to it. Give it to her. I don't know if we're supposed to, like, go somewhere else for the time being and then come back. As far as I'm concerned right now, that's... That's it. Must have something down here. There's nothing else. For whatever reason, I feel like it's supposed to be a bigger ending than that. Unless we're just supposed to leave and come back. But go check. For whatever reason, I just feel like there's so much more to that. Uh, than what we're seeing.
So let's see if there's anything else that's happening. My thanks. I will if of a cold one day. Well, someone, oh, you know what? It was one. Crap. One area that I should have checked. Um. Cleansing Chapel. But that's where the um, Ariando was, uh, was painted. Or rather, that's where Gail was. Plus, he's not here anymore. I figured there'd be something else. Oh, but apparently not. So, I'm hoping I'm not missing anything. That seems to be the end of it. It seems to be uh, just something that comes in like full circle, you know. You meet, you know, this old, with your old, old man who turns out to be Gale. And he. Still has a piece of his niece's shrine. I mean of his niece's uh of his niece's painting. Then it sucks you into Ariando where you go against Sister Freda and what have you. Then it goes to the Ring City where you actually have to fight Gale himself. So Gale is the one who introduced you to the DLC. I mean, he's the one who, you know, that you need to get into the DLC at first, and then it rounds off with him being a final boss, so most definitely somebody that, um, most definitely somebody that I think is, uh, Ah, uh, makes you want to feel sad for the guy a little bit. But, tried to kill me, so I killed him. Yeah, I really don't want to get this free sword, because I know I'm not going to use it. I'd rather just get this. <coughs> Excuse me. Since we got it. How about we check it out for ourselves? I think it's not working, unless I gotta put it on this side. It's not working. Assume stance. That's not bad. I wish I didn't waste my arrows on this thing, but nevertheless. Thank you guys for watching the Ring City DLC. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Till next time. Peace.